the first thing you have to do is construct your musical cues. In this case, the composer was from England, composed and executed the instrumental score, which was then shipped over to North Carolina. You create a Pro Tool edit session, setting your left-right stereophonic score at the bottom. Then you bring in your key solo vocalist. He or she wears headsets, listening to the score which is fed to them from the Pro Tool session. The vocalist is recorded as many times as it may take. In this case, the key vocalist sang this section twice. I was born in the back room of an Italian American deli. My father worked his hand to the bone. Then you bring in your chorus back up. Each one of them also wears headsets so they can hear the score as well as the solo vocalist that has already been recorded. They will record as many takes as they deem necessary. In this case, four takes were recorded. However, they were layered. After each take, the chorus members change position, both from left to right and right to left, as well as back to front. By layering the takes, a handful of singers will sound like a much larger group. You can use your laptop computer right on the set using the custom DVD that you prepared all the master music cues along with all of the Apple, Baker, Charlie shortened cues with pre-play click tracks. Insert your custom DVD into your laptop computer. Select which cue icon you want and select. The music cue will instantly start with the rhythm click cue. So we have chosen Cube Buddy Part 1, QM1 Master. You can use as many cameras as you either need or can afford. In this case, we are using two cameras. You will use a 1 8 inch mini plug stereo output from your headset port on the side of your computer, and using an adapter, you will feed the signal into your audio mixer. You will send an output of the music cue to a monitor speaker that can be heard clearly by everyone on the set. The production boom operator will be miking as usual, except the boom operator will be picking up the music from the speaker along with any other noises or spoken dialogue not in the musical score. This audio track, as heard by the boom microphone, will be recorded on a separate dedicated channel on the recording mixer's digital recorder. This will only be a sync guide track for post-production editorial use in order to cue for future ADR sessions or sound effect matching. Most likely, this will be on channel 1, or if the boom operator is recording with a stereo mic, it may be on channels 1 and 2. Playback operator will send a clean music track signal from the playback mixer to the recording mixer's digital recorder onto dedicated stereo channels, probably channels 3 and 4. The clapper operator sets up in positions so that both cameras can see the slate and will have what is called a common marker with one clap. The first assistant director has verified that everybody is ready and then calls out. Roll sound. The production mixer rolls his or her digital recorder. Understand that no one can do anything and nothing can start until the production mixer is satisfied with what he or she hears, that the equipment is working correctly, 
the signal is clear and settled, then the production mixer will call out. Speed. The first assistant director calls out. Roll cameras. The cameras roll. The first camera operator is satisfied with his camera and is up to speed and calls out. A camera rolling. The cameras roll. The second camera operator is satisfied with his camera and is up to speed and calls out. B camera rolling. The first assistant director cues the clapper assistant to visually clap sync by calling out. Mark it. The clapper assistant calls out the setup designation. Buddy, scene one, take three, common marker. After clapping sync, the clapper operator scrambles out of the way as the first assistant director is satisfied that everything is rolling the way it should be. The director is happy and calls, Ready and action. The first assistant director calls out for the playback operator to roll the music cue. Playback. The playback operator hits the space bar of his or her laptop computer, rolling the selected cue that the entire crew has prepared to shoot. As the music cue is heard through the monitor speakers, the cast lip syncs their voices to the pre-recorded cue. I was born in the back room of an Italian American deli. My father worked his hand to the bone just to fill our bellies. As we discussed before, the boom operator's microphone is picking up both the music played back through the monitor speaker as well as any spoken dialogue or sound effects that transpire on the set during the performance. Past, I swore my family would never grow hungry. I said, I'm gonna build me a pizza parlor. That's how I'll make my money. As we discussed before, the production mixer is capturing a clean stereophonic transfer from the playback operator's computer feed on separate dedicated channels. I start off with tomato sauce on a fluffy white bed of dough. Then I bake it at 400 degrees and send it through. Once the scene is over, the director calls out. And cut. Yes, yeah. that's, that's fine. Let's check the gate, guys. Let's get go. That's good. Let's, let's do one more. Select which cue icon you want and select. The music cue will instantly start with the rhythm click cue. Once again, the clapper operator sets up and positions so that both cameras can see the slate and will have what is called a common marker with one clap. Once again, the first assistant director has verified that everybody is ready and then calls out. Roll sound. Once again, the production mixer rolls the digital recorder. Once the production mixer is satisfied that the signal is clear and the equipment is running smooth, the production mixer will call out. Speed. Once again, the first assistant director calls out. Roll cameras. Once again, the cameras roll. The first camera operator is satisfied with his camera and is up to speed and calls out. A camera rolling. The second camera operator is satisfied with his camera and is up to speed and calls out. B camera rolling. Once again, the first assistant director cues the clapper assistant to visually clap sync by calling out. Mark it. Once again, the clapper assistant calls out the setup designation. Buddy, scene one, Baker, take one, common marker. Once again, the clapper operator scrambles out of the way as the first assistant director is satisfied that everything is rolling the way it should be. And set. Once again, the director is happy and calls. Ready and action.
Once again, the first assistant director calls out for the playback operator to roll the music cue. Playback. Once again, the playback operator rolls the selected cue that the entire crew has prepared to shoot. My father worked his hand to the bone just to fill our bellies. Once again, the music cue is heard through the monitor speakers and the cast lip syncs their voices to the pre-recorded cue. The years, Once again, the boom the operator's microphone passed. is picking up both the I music playback as well as any spoken dialogue during the performance. Hungry, I said. I'm gonna build Once again, the production mixer is capturing a clean stereophonic transfer from the playback operator's computer feed. Once again, this scene is over. The director calls out. And cut. And that's how you should shoot a musical. Excellent. Let's do one more. Buddy, scene one. Baker, take one. Common marker. Ready and action. I swore my family would never grow hungry. I said, I'm going to build me a pizza parlor. That's how I'll make my money.
day again. Perhaps one day we'll fall in love and dance together in the I'm doing great. That'll be $22.50.